Halo, ini Quindle dan hari ini aku mau ajarin kamu bagaimana bisa ngomong kayak aku. I don't know why you want to, but if you do, stick around. This is how to talk like a Kiwi. Untuk orang-orang lain, untuk kamu, how we talk might sound weird, <laughs> but to us, obviously, it's just our normal. Kita pindah ke sini pas aku kecil. And I've basically lived here all my life, hence the accent. And I've gotten some really nice compliments from you guys regarding my accent. So thank you. But I also can't take credit for those compliments because this is just how my accent is. It's not a skill I've mastered, so as proud as I am of it, I still can't take credit for it. If it's a skill that you want to master, this will perhaps help you do that. So one of the most noticeable features of a New Zealand accent is that we don't pronounce our R's. And I'm, I'm saying the letter R, by the way, not a. <laughs> we don't pronounce our R's in most cases, like the word car, or cord, or or. We do pronounce our R's when it's before a vowel, usually, like in the word umbrella. So in most cases, kita nggak bilang R di dalam kata-kata, tapi kita bilang huruf R Kolo sublom a vowel, mostly. The second distinct feature about a Kiwi accent is how we pronounce our vowels. Take these words for example, left and lift, pen and pin. Ada dua kata yang terkenal when it comes to distinguishing a New Zealand accent. Dua kata itu adalah deck. So we have a deck just out there. When I say deck, I mean dick, not dick. Dan six. And when I say six, I mean six, not six. See, to me that all sounds normal. Jadi kalau kamu mau ngomong kayak orang New Zealander, vowelsnya harus di... Apa ya? How do I describe it? You know what I mean. Just do it like that. Now if you want to sound more like a Kiwi, kamu bisa pakai kata-kata ini. Sweet atau sweet as. Those are used in place of yep or okay. Jadi kalau ada teman kamu tanya let's meet at 10 a.m. tomorrow and you can respond and say sweet or sweet as. Kalau kamu mau ajak teman-teman main kamu bisa pakai kata keen kayak anyone keen to go to the beach and people will probably respond yeah I'm keen. Kita bilang togs untuk baju berenang kita bilang cheers as a more informal way of bilang terima kasih. Dan kalau kamu nggak sengaja senggol orang pas jalan, kamu bilang minta maaf. Terus orang di sini mungkin bilang you're alright as a way to say no worries or don't worry about it or that's okay. So that's it basically from what I can think of anyway. It's all normal. Normal is relative. My normal is different to your normal. Everyone's normal, everyone's weird, we're all the same, we're all equal. You know what? The best way to talk like a Kiwi is to come here. Kalau kamu mau tinggal di sini dan jadi mahasiswa di sini, aku bisa bantu kamu. I and a few other people run an education agency based here in Auckland and in Jakarta as well where we can help you come here and live here and become a student. We help you with anything and everything you need. So that's things from finding the right accommodation, applying for your visas, and obviously finding the right course or university for you. So if that's something you're interested in, kalau kamu mau atau penasaran, kasih tahu ya. I also make videos on that channel about living in New Zealand and tips on how to come here and how to live here. <laughs> so check that out. Okay, this is the actual outro now. <laughs> there.